So we're going to pop back down to Daytona Beach, Florida. Last week, we introduced you to Marisol Quigley, and I promised to show you an interview that we had. So here we are back on the beach, and Jan and Marisol, and yours truly up front. And here goes the interview. Okay, I'm standing here with a Filipino who is living here in America and has been married for nine years. And I just learned that she is a Florida state champion in what? Taekwondo. In Taekwondo, okay. yeah. <laughs> so, Filipinas. Yeah, so you're even uh, a judge. And uh, I noticed on the marquee at the Daytona Beach, whatever it is, uh, the pavilion there, uh, convention center, whatever, that they're having um, competition. Yes. And you'll be judging there? Yes, sir. And then you'll be going also to Tennessee at some point? Yes, sir. And then next month I'll be in Emerson, Georgia for the district tournament. Okay, so what do you have to do to become a champion Taekwondo person? Um, you just keep going into the tournament and, you know, when you go to your ring, it's uh, nerve-wracking, but you just have to try the best. <laughs> so, you're a very tall person. <laughs> uh, so, by definition, at least 5 foot 2, because you have to be 5 foot 2 to be a person in the Philippines. In the Philippines, yes. <laughs> It's a job. Yeah. So, maybe we're squeezing that a little bit. But anyway, um, so you, you take on people who are bigger? Yes. Some of them are like 5'6", five, 5'7". Five, so, okay. Yeah. Uh, always ladies? Yes. Okay. So, what's the actual title uh, of your championship? So, I'm going to be a Florida State Champ for uh, Extreme Weapon Forms and Extreme Creative Forms. So, I could hire you as my bodyguard? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> but I think you work in the pharmaceutical yes, sir. industry. Yeah. I work in the, one of the top 10 pharmaceutical companies. Okay, we won't tell. <laughs> Oh yeah, I should I should say that. <laughs> okay, so Oops. your 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 name for the record. My name is Marisol Quigley. All right. Well, welcome to America, even though it's your home now. Yes. Thank uh, you. And yet we've just had a very good visit here. We're standing at Daytona Beach, and here are the lovely waves. Yesterday was the Whirl 1000, uh, and today we met the female state champion for the state of Florida. Taekwondo. Yay. Yeah, thank you so much. Thank you. So there you have that interview, and we're missing the waves, the sunshine, and the sand. Well, actually, we do have sunshine here. So some were asking about what uh, Marisol was doing here, and um, we asked her about this. How did she get this kind of air under her? And she said she just set up her camera, set it going, and she practiced jumping straight up. And some asked for a close-up of her head uh, because they weren't sure what this black strap was. It looked like maybe a mustache or something, but uh, that's all that is. It's just a strap that became airborne. And here's another picture and a different positioning of the same strap. And underneath the pier and a different outfit, no strap. And what's for lunch? Aha. Uh -huh. Jan made a tofu spread with turmeric uh, as the coloring and uh, some salad dressing and a big slice of tomato and a few chips and uh, some vitamins and I see my vitamin D there. So we were blessed. Actually, this might have been supper. But anyway, hope you all have a blessed weekend.